Apple Pay has just rolled out. The idea is that instead of reaching for my wallet, I can just uh, wave my iPhone to pay for everything from groceries to a cab ride to coffee at the coffee shop. But you know, here in New York, we're always a little skeptical that something this big and complicated is going to work right out of the box. So we decided to take it to the streets and test it out. It's asking me to enter my card number, but I can also take a picture. And that's what I'll do. And there we go. I've got my debit card is all set up for Apple Pay. I'm going to add a couple more cards by hitting the plus button up here. All right, uh, we're good to go. I've got it loaded up on my phone, and now we're going to head out and see how it works. I'm going to take my wallet with me just in case. So one place we've been told that Apple Pay is supposed to work today is in New York City cabs. So that's what we're going to try. Trouble is, first we're going to have to find a cab. Hi. The carousel in Central Park, if the uh, Central Park Road is open. The symbol here is supposed to be telling me that I can pay with my phone. Okay, so we're going to pay, and we're going to tip, and I'm, we're going to swipe, and uh, it is asking for my card, and there we go. We're done. Thank you. Well, that actually worked pretty well. So now that we're here, uh, we're going to try something else. We're going to see if we can use this to buy a New York City pretzel. Oh, you, you take pay, Apple Pay or just, just, just cash? Oh, no, it's just cash. Just cash? Okay. I got you. There you go. So this works, but in New York City, you still don't want to leave home without a $20 bill. <laughs>